for me, I like the landscape of yeah. this school. It has mm -hmm. so much potential. And, and we, we have the land. We have the land, the land that, is there. Yeah, we have the land that uh, we, we can get more structures on the land to convert the, the school into a boarding school. Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. My name is Gosses, of course. My first school in Central Region. The way I have suffered to be here. Oh, the Pons Senior High School, you know, we're working with Central Region Education Office. A very big shout out to the Central Region Education Director, Madam Justine Apau. We can't appreciate you enough. Now, they told me we have over 70 plus senior high schools in Central Region. And then I'm going to do my best to visit them all. But the way I have suffered to be here, fool, fool, it's not easy, fool. Somebody put it in the comment section. He said that I should put no momo there so that um, you people will support with fuel. But I thought through the thing. Uh, say, hey. See, if you know anybody who works in the fuel company, um, Goyle, Shell, Allied, Petrosol, Star Oil, Blanco, all of the filling stations, the fuel, the petrol, petroleum company, please. Tell them that they should come and support everything that is happening here. Because these students, they need a lot of support. They need a lot of capacity building. They need career guidance. And that's exactly what we're doing. Please, look into your contacts and then ask somebody to get in touch. And also the corporate world, those who are into um, beverages and all that, the Milo and Nestle Ghana and all that, please, get us help. We really need it. Now I am here. Let me confess, when I first heard the name Odupont Senior High School, I thought I was coming to meet a school with just two blocks, two short blocks and 15 desks. Look at the gate. Look at the gate. Look. But the head prefect is waiting for me. Let me go and meet him. He will say a lot about this school. Ha. Ah, bro. Oh, I bro. Bro. Who do we have here? <laughs> the guy himself. <laughs> How are you? Fine. 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 I can't believe I've made it to your school. Yes, and you are, you are very lucky. The whole, to my school. The way I have suffered to be here. Uh, I collected you, five Ghana from this person, 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 from this person to buy four. Okay. And I finally made it here. Tell them that they should sponsor me. Please, sponsor him. Uh, you see, if, if, you, if you hadn't sponsored you, you wouldn't have been in a nice mm -hmm. environment like this. Mm -hmm. uh, there are, more, there are, in, there are mm -hmm. nice environments like Udupon Senior High School that um, I have to our be gentleman there. here should be. You uh, see? And, oh. And, and, and among all the senior high schools, I think this is the first and the best senior high school that um, he, he has ever seen. In, in this country? Yes, in, in this, this country. Yes. In this country. Yes. This, this is a local. Hey, this is the environment. I have heard about some schools. I have not been there yet. They say they are. Don't worry, we will get there. <laughs> but of course, it's a very beautiful school. I want to know something about this school. Where it is, the location, I mean, something about this school and the community. Oh. They also want to know. Oh, okay. But before that, of course, you have to introduce yourself to us. Yes. All right. Um, I am His Excellency Kasim Abdul Fatal. His Excellency? Yes, His Excellency. His Excellency? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> the head boy, you know, the most senior high school. So by yeah. here, they, they, they call you His Excellency. Yes. That's the title they give you. Yes. When you come to the Pons senior high school, um, the head prefects are called Excellencies. Excellencies. Yes, then the honorables um, are the other prefects. Oh, okay. The entertainment, the protocol, and the rest. So I am an Excellency. My girls prefects are an Excellency. The assistants are Excellencies. Is this something you just came up with or it's been here since? Mm -hmm. It's let me say something that we came up with. Your batch, yes, our yearbook. Yeah. Amazing. Where did you get that inspiration from? Um, I've been watching uh, high school programs, and I see <laughs> this thing, master, and the rest. I was like, no, we are not going to use master. We are going to change it. We want the actual state system. <laughs> so we are going to use the Nado Dankwa's title. <laughs> His Excellency. Yes. And that is you. Yes. That What's is. the name again? His Excellency Kasim Abdul Fatal. Kasim Abdul Fatal. Yes. Amazing. Mm. And it's, it's very coincidental that you people are you are you are fasting. The Ramadan is happening. I understand yes. it's ending tomorrow. It end it's end yesterday. It's it ended, ended yesterday. It ended yesterday. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, actually So when is the big party? 
some people are praying today after the ramadan we have to pray some people are praying today but we want to follow the chief imam since we are in school we okay. can't leave today is not a holiday okay so we want to follow the national chief imam to pray tomorrow he is praying tomorrow let's talk about the importance where's the big party because I understand they cook a lot. They cook, they, you, you do uh, cow. You kill cow people. Oh, you eat it. yeah, yeah, yeah. But that, that is not for this particular Eid. Eh. Yes, we have the Eid Adda and the Eid Fitr. It's the Eid Adda that we slaughter those animals. Ah. In. But with this one, we are breaking our fast. Oh, okay. A one month fast, we are breaking it. So oh, okay. We just cook some food and small. Eat. That one is personal. Yes. There's the one that is for the whole community to come and enjoy. Yes, to come in some months. Oh, time. okay. Yeah. I understand mm. knowledge. <laughs> I, well, I have seen a lot of bikes here. Uh, you see, this place is a day school. This school is a day school. Actually, the name is Odukon Community Senior High uh, Day School. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. So some students are from the house. Actually, we have a hostel. We have hostels around that some of us are in the hostel, but some people are in the house with their parents. So when they are coming, see now the well, the fair is becoming too much. So they prefer using the bicycle to come from the house. That's why they park them. You have a whole lot of them there. Mm. They are not just small bicycles. Let's go and check up on some of them. Very quality bicycles. Yes. Amazing. Just as the school is quality, the students... They have to get a quality oh, yes. bicycle. So when you are coming, they will know that this is a student of Odupon with a quality uniform, quality uh, personality and quality bicycle as well. <laughs> Amazing. They've locked all of them up. Yes. That's so that nobody will come and take them. And this is also a training. We are training them that if you grow you get you get your what do you call it your private cars your motors when you pack them you have to lock them so this is this one lock them. we check them the locking and this we check ah. yes unless maybe the person doesn't have lock that is when we ask them to pack it there because the security man we've asked him not to um pay much attention to this side he has a whole lot to do over there so you come you lock it unless maybe ah. you don't have it yes so you can see even those yes everyone has locked so a bicycle is locked. Awesome. Mm. Now, Karim, tell me something about this school. Fatau. Where it, Fatau. Yes. I should add a Fatau. Yes. I like to say Karim. Kasim. Kasim. Kasim Fatau. Ka hey. ah. Yes, Kasim, Kasim. Fatau. Kasim Fatau. Yeah. Yes. So, bro, yeah. tell me something about this school. Where it is like mm. this. Tell me something. Well, the Pong Senior High School is not that old. Just seven years old, I think. Uh, it was established in the year 2016 by the former um, president his excellency john ramani mahama i respect i respect him a lot <laughs> <laughs> i know why you are saying you are doing this of course <laughs> it's obvious <laughs> yeah, i respect him a lot um, we've had so many successes and failures actually this school is in uh, the senior east constituency okay let me say it is the only public senior high school in this constituency eh. yes because if i look back left right i don't see any other senior high school unless the private ones Unless Amazing. the private ones here. When you come to Kasua and you want a senior high school, you have to come to the one senior high school. That is the um, only senior high school we have in the Kasua vicinity. And um, over the years, we've had about four headmasters. Um, our first mama, Mama Cynthia, she came, she started from 2016, I think, to 17. Then Mama Marjorie came, she took over. Then also, along the way, we, we, had, a, we had a pa. A yeah, father. father. He also came here. Yeah, An actual AJ. father. He was a father. Like no, a I, 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 I call them moms and pa. Oh, okay. Yes, okay. Because, uh, so he also came. Uh, Daddy AJ. Okay. okay. And now we have the. <laughs> I really respect that man a lot. He is my role model. He's my everything. The headmaster. What's everything. His, what's his name? Uh, Mr. Uh, Bismarck in Oklabi. Okay, Mr. Bismarck in Oklabi. You know, when I showed up here, I met him there. Yes. He was a very majestic He is the him. reason why I am here today. He he has molded me to this, uh, to how I am today. Amazing. Yes, I look up to him. Since I came to this school, I look up to him. So everything I do is small of him. When you, when you get there, you see that, no. I've but definitely talked to him. Of, yes, yes. You get to know that I'm more of him. Oh, I, really, I really expect him. <laughs> I really respect him. Okay, over here we have our. Um, that's where we um, pour the refuse down there. Yes. Okay. I think now we want to put a stop to it because we have dustbins around, so we want to pack them in the dustbin. So we don't we pour them there, but not that much. Come and see something. You have a whole lot of them in the bush. Are they not working the dustbins? Yes, I think my grandfather didn't go around today because today there will be a program here, so they were actually here. 
Okay. So the genius, you see, when you ask them to work, they don't want to work. So maybe after that, they just put it there. You, your genius, they don't want to work. They don't want to work. Why? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, they want uh, the seniors to work for them. I, I just don't know. Most times, I'll be in the classroom, they'll bring report. This person have done this. I'll call for DC and we'll do. DC is what? Yes. Disciplinary committee. Okay. We have that of the main head, uh, the assistant headmaster. He's in charge. Then we have, when you come to the prefect level, I am in charge. So when there are main, main issues, you don't take it up there. Okay. Because you really hold them prestige. They are very, very... Um, Expected you don't take anyone to their home. Uh, so you office. gather yourself and you trash it out yes. down here. Trash it out, deal with it, settle it. <laughs> yeah. So I think they did this job. I will, I will see to it. Later. I wanted to find out something about the occupation of the people here, the language they speak, and um, in the chief. You mm -hmm. have a chief here. Yes, the chief's name is actually a. Uh, Nine Awushi Tete the second. Okay. Yes. Nine Awushi Tete. That's the paramount. That the paramount. And also the occupation. Initially they were into farming. Yeah, so we have when you come to this place is um Jeriva. Mm. As part of a pan call, this place is called Jeriva. So we have the Jeriva farm over there. Okay. And now the, the farm is becoming smaller. I don't know. They are not operating there again. So I think it is vanishing. Okay. Uh, and also um you ask of the occupation, yes. The name of the chief. The chief. And the language. They speak what language here? They speak the Breku language, but for the written, we normally write the Fante. Okay. And so when you come, you are more of the Fante. Everyone speaks Fante. That's why when you go up there, our administration, everyone Fante. And myself, I speak Fante. Okay. And I have to learn it, even though I'm a Muslim. Amazing. Yes. Is this your school canteen? This is our school canteen. And they well prepared food when you want to eat you come to this place when you want to eat good food come to yeah, you come here come here you get good food to eat <laughs> this that be special she said we should come there <laughs> we are coming we are coming there <laughs> you, you can, you can. <laughs> <laughs> what if we come from the country what if we come from the <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we're going to have an exchange program here in the school. Yes, yeah, since you are here, I know that will happen. Yes. That is what we you have do. an exchange program here. You have, what, what you have this is the education office. Uh -huh, this I forgot of one thing. Gosh, we are really lucky. With the post senior high school, we are blessed. That is what I'm saying. We are blessed is that when you come to this um what do you call it? It's now a ministry. Let's put it that way. It's now becoming a ministry. And mm. uh, this is the center of the ministry. We are in the center of the ministry because we have the education office here. Over there, we have the national insurance um, office. It's also have, over there. Yes, we have the high court over there. We, we have, have the, a court here. Yes, we have the court there. Um, recently, I think some months ago, the president came around. The of president, the Republic. Yes, yes, his excellent Nana Dunkle Kufar. He came around. He he came to visit the court, but he couldn't make it to this place. He couldn't make it to this place because he was going to Bajasi. Mm. Yes, there was a road there was going there so he couldn't make it to here but you know one day he will come when they are finally done and they want to open the uh, courts so that is what i'm saying we are blessed that is the Wait, of the head those three students going they will stood there for you to pass to pass why yes because i'm coming the school fair time i'm coming you also do freezing here yes they have to stop for you to pass yes i will say anything <laughs> <laughs> yes, i will say anything <laughs> Since we are using the government, uh, the nation system, we have to stand for. We are trying to even bring up the um, the commander in chief for the cadets things. You see, the president is the commander in chief for the army. Yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah, we are yeah. trying to bring up that thing. So maybe it will start on the children, the, have, the upcoming from the upcoming prefects. So, from so, so with that, what what is going to happen? So with that, um, the Champion. SRC president, with that, the SRC president becomes the commander in chief. Then they will give him a what do you call it? A security personnel mm. from the cadet. So in terms of assembly, worship, and other social they will follow the person. So it will be like university practice. Exactly. Amazing. Yeah. I like this thing. Yes. It looks so like new. It. Who did it? The visual art department. Our our noble visual art department. They did this. Wow. Mm. Yeah, hard working. They spent the ten days in school while we were at home. They spent the ten days to design this. And actually, we have our, we will be having our exhibition coming um, next week. Yes, next, next week. week. Yes. Ah, I should have come here yes, next on week. that day. So the whole place will be nice. We've made arrangements. Wow. This is, when you. I like the lawns. 
of this place uh, how you've kept this place so clean it's so beautiful like seriously uh, there are so many preparations to it nobody uses this side if like on it you yes. don't work on it we don't work we don't work on it unless maybe you are going to work in there mm. uh, aside working in there with no one works there so you can see that the labor have done some work over there yes no one goes there even with the picking we have some people who go there to pick because because it's a uh, grass we don't want people to be stepping in there that's how that's why it is like this till now so how many uh, programs do you do here we offer we have the general arts science and agric we have the visual arts we have the um home economics yes and the business business so five probably so this that blocks down here they are for what the can you see how your classroom look like yes you can see how This one is uh, room 13. This one is room 13. Is what? The class of. Um, <coughs> class Hello. General Art Good Today. afternoon. Amazing. The class of General Art 2. General Art 2. Yes. You oh, see okay. how conducive the class is. Fans and we are not supposed Amazing. We are. We are. We are. Amazing. When you come to the Post Senior High School, you study with sound mind. Sound mind. Sound mind. So you get everything. Some schools are still struggling to own a uh, fan. Uh, yeah. even desk student desk but you have all of them mm -hmm. and then up block do you have labs here yes we have labs this is uh, we can go there let's go there yes, yes. when you enter in our lab you're going to see the perfection of everything uh, it's exquisite. everything is arranged well we have the this is the chemistry lab <sighs> this is my our chemistry lab this is where we mix the amazing the titration, yes, the, the acids and those things. And <laughs> yeah, this place is so cool, eh? Yes, looks like there is an air conditioner, even though there is no air conditioner here. But yes, looks like there is an air conditioner here. So a place like this, when you come, you wouldn't have anything to do than to study because the place is very, very mm. conducive, very well. So I want to, I want to find out. Mm. Here is Kaswa of our call. Yes, please. The students that are in this school, are they all from this area? Yes. Not all. Yes, but not all. Um, I can say maybe 25% of them are far, far away. Because currently we have a student who is from Kumasi. Senior, uh, Kumasi. Kumasi. Yes, and he's, he's even born. So he went for the break and he's not back. That is just a student that we know for now. Mm. Wow. Yeah. But others too are from Accra. We have those from Bajuasi, Bajuasi, yes, and the rest. But the rest are people who are around Kaswa. So when you come here, you meet Kaswa. Amazing. Yes. So you only have one lab here, right? Yes. They, this is the chemistry lab. The chemistry lab. Yes. We have the physics lab too. This is the biology lab. So we go into the biology lab. Over here too, you see perfection of everything. So awesome. this is the biology lab. Today. Classes in section, amazing. And they are having a class over yes. here. Oh, Charlie, so, look at your tile. Mm, so we clean it every day. You clean it we, every day. We clean it every day. That's the cleaning. Uh, the yeah, seniors on duty see to it. See to it that the form ones. I want us to use this take So we okay. go to the other other labs. Okay. Uh, we have other labs as top here. Actually, this is a disability work we friendly. Disability this, work with. Uh, See, some people have problems. They can't use their normal staircase. Uh, disabled. Sorry. Wow. Yes, disabled. They use this staircase. Okay, so we are marching to the labs that we have up here. We have another lab up here. Yes, we have another lab up here. This place is the Home Economics Department. We have practicals, we have economic practicals. Good afternoon. We have economic Hello. practicals here. Good morning. Oh, okay. We sell some stuff here. Wow. This is, this are five. When you come to the one, you are safe. <laughs> when your mother brings you to the post, you are safe. It is one thing that I advocate for any time I go to a high school. Mm. When I enter a high school and I don't see an extinguisher, it becomes a worry to be uh, because this is something that every school is supposed to have. I like 20 of them everywhere. Yes. And also, 
do, do the student know how to use this? We are here to teach the student how to use it. Because it's very necessary. Okay. It's very necessary. Each and everyone should know how to draw Stephen. Let's step And out. with the student of Odupon, I think even without, there is a lab here. Okay. I think even without the teaching, without teaching them how to use it, some of them, when you come here, students are very talented. Okay, so, so maybe they can use it all by themselves without yes. knowing how to use it. I don't yes. believe you. I think it should be taught. Okay, okay. Deliberately. That's what I'm saying. Some. 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 Yeah, some students. Because sometimes we want students to do some things for us and the student will just rise up. I'll do it. And the person will do it. With. Like last week, we were, we, were, we were having a general cleaning. We wanted someone to uh, sharpen the knives for us. So we were, they just were doing it and all of a sudden, a form one boy came up that he can do it and he was able to do it. Amazing. So I think there are some students who can do this too. This is the physics lab. The, the physics lab. Mm -hmm. Physics lab. You don't have tools here, equipment, I don't know. We have the... equipment. They are inside here. Yeah. That is why it's with they uh, them. Strictly out of bonds of students. Yes. We've locked them because some students are very, very um, stubborn. When you ask them not to touch, they are going to touch it. So, and it's very, very important to the school. Well, there is we having radicals. I have yeah, I wanted to I wanted to ask about this. What is this? This is where we keep our sachet um sachet after drinking our water. Okay, so we don't mix them with the rabbit. So this one after the teachers and the department heads they will see to that they make substitution. They take out the sachet from the rubbish okay. itself. So this one we use it for something. We give it out to those who recycle and the rest. In Western region. There is an initiative in the high schools there, mm -hmm. initiated by the Western Region Education Director. It's called Pick As You Go. Have you ever heard of it before? Yes, I've heard of it. And we wanted to bring this thing. It's uh, because of our busy schedules, we couldn't um, implement it. We couldn't bring it up. But we thought of it. When we were elected, when we were inaugurated as prophets, we thought of bringing it back. Because of our busy schedules, we couldn't um, make it. But we are since we are here and we've also pumped this. Yes. Right after you leave, you have to put it to work. It is very, very important. This, this is our stores. Your what? Stores. Where we keep our things. Files. Yes, not not files, they say books that the government brings, the uh, oh, okay. T shirts and everything. Okay. okay. That the government brings. Okay. These are the uh, what do you call it? the metal stands. Yes. Now they are no no longer useful. Now we don't have corona. COVID is <laughs> how Corona is no game. more. Yeah. Amazing. Mm. So this is the first floor. This is the first floor. First floor. The floors are three. This is, so we have three classroom blocks. And when you go behind there, there is a this is your class. That is not my class. This is the class of um the academic prefects. Academic prefects. Yes. Please, where the academic prefects? Academic prefects is here. Uh, brother, academic how are you? You, you are the academic prefect. Yes, sir. Amazing. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Too. What, what is your name? My name is Enoch Lauta. Enoch Lauta. 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 Yes. Oh, okay. Amazing. You have a very nice school. I was, I was talking to uh, His Excellency. I was talking to His Excellency about an initiative called Pick As You Go. Have you heard Pick As You Go? No. You've never heard of it. Yes. What it means is that when you are walking around campus and then you see a trash, you have to pick it. It doesn't matter who you are, whether you are the Grand Circle Prefect, the Dining Hall Prefect, whatever. So far as you are walking and you saw the trash, you have to pick it. It is working in all the schools in Western Region. So when a student is working on campus and they see something on the floor, they will pick it. And then they will go and so they have very clean campuses. And I think it is something you can also do it. What do you think? And I am Pasia Sam. I am Pasia Sam. Yes. So excellent. Thank you very much. <laughs> this place too, it's a place that really one is gone. That's yeah. where are. We they are we, we took it out there from that we took it out from that place. Oh, it is, okay. it is, it's not gone. So sometimes students come here to stand to have fresh air, keep in fresh air. Because because the air around here is very, 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 very old. Awesome. Children coming to school, they ask us to make sure we have the cardigan because this place is very, very cool. Very cool. The weather here is very cool. Even though it's a day school, but you still have to bring a cardigan here. Yes. But we it's come for cool. prayer. 
Eh. We come for prep. We the hostelers. We those in the hostels. We so you prep. have a hostel. You live in a hostel. Yes, around hostel. here. That is it. The the brown roof. No, yes, not the brown. Roof, the green roof, rather. The one the man is on it. Or oh, where the mosque is? Yeah, where the mosque is. Okay. That is where our hostel that oh, is. Okay. The school's hostel. Amazing. So we come for prep, we come to learn. Everything here is just as um, the boarding school. But, but the way, way the school is, how it is structured, and how active it is, you need a boarding facility here. Yes, that is our hey, problem. They need a boarding facility here. It's very important yes. because where it is, the the landscape of this place is very beautiful mm. and um i i don't know but i feel like the school administration might have a bit challenge with regulating the student mm. because it's a day a community day school yes you know some students are very recalcitrant if you tell them that don't go out at this time they're, they're going to go out uh, and yes. they are not housed they don't have seniors, masters, or whatever it is. That so is the, that is the main problem in this. School. That, that's the main that problem. The in main this problem in this. I'm school. a prophet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when it comes to this, you know that this is the problem. That is the main problem. You see, our academics and everything is excellence now. We are only left with we use the other stake. So, so we should go, go to the way. other floor. Yes. Okay. So yeah. so I think it should be considered a boarding facility should be put over here for. For these people yes, yes. Uh, your school came up um in the year 2016 right mm -hmm. yes so it's not been really that long mm -hmm. so there is not enough alumni can do for the school mm -hmm. they don't really have active alumni okay mm -hmm. so um so this is the hall of excellence this is assembly hall yes assembly hall Amazing. good afternoon hello good afternoon this is the Hall of Excellence. Uh, this is actually the place we should be having our assemblies. Oh, okay. But we have it down there where they are having the program. Yeah, okay. Because we think that place is okay for the cinema. But sometimes when it happens that we should do a program here, we do audit here. Are yeah, these four months? Yes, these are four months. You see, one of the problems is that we don't have um, adequate classrooms. That is the so the SLC badge. We've planned that before we leave. I think at, at least. To be able to put up a uh, structure, even if it's one classroom for the full one, oh, okay. they can be used. If it happens that we have a meeting or examination, we all have to go out and sit. Today, we are very lucky using the headmaster's work with <laughs> only the headmaster. Hey. Only the headmaster. Amazing. Myself, I think this is the second time I'm using this place. Amazing. Yes. No one uses this place. And this one is a library. Yes, yeah, this is the library. So, before we enter the library, this is the headmaster's office. Okay. This yeah. place, yes. This place, nobody uses this place. You don't, you don't um, use this place to your, to wherever you are going to. If you are from that class, you want to come to a library, you descend down, use the stand headmaster's place, then you enter the library. Ah. Yes. You don't have to use the headmaster's workroom. So this is for only the headmaster. Wow. And this is the library. This is the library, sir. Amazing. Good afternoon, sir. Wow. So, it's in only the point that <laughs> the library looks very nice like this. Was I this guess. donated by somebody or the government built it? We, entirely? Came, we came to meet it. So, oh, I okay. think it's part of the government's okay. projects. Yes. We can have different um, novel for European, um, the European novels and stuff. We have the African novels. Have that of religions, different, 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 different books. I want to look at this. Uh, okay, it looks like a book that we read in high school called Silas Manor. Oh, okay, they don't have it here. Mm -hmm. You don't have it. Do you have The Joys of Motherhood? The Joys of Motherhood, I think it's a book that every human being should. The joys of motherhood. You see, when you come to the point now, everything is here. Hey, everything, you have to read this book. Everything is here. Wow! Gucci and Mechita is a Nigerian writer. Yes. This woman, every human being should read this book. The joys of motherhood. You cry, you cry. We have to announce this on Monday. You have to announce it. Yes. So that they all come and read it. 
Amazing. So this is the library too. I think the library is very cool. I like to see the headmaster. So I was telling head boy that when I first heard of the Senior High School, in my mind I was thinking of just two small two blocks <laughs> <laughs> somewhere with about seven chairs with mm -hmm. students. And I showed up here and I realized that wow, is this what this is part of the e block that was built by the government. Yeah. The first time I saw one was at um Sanko Senior High School in Western Region. But yours looks modified. Mm. I don't know. It's it's really glorious and it's very beautiful. Mm. And the vegetation you have down there, it makes the school really beautiful. I also do understand that it's been around since 2016. 2016. 2016. Say, I would like to know your personal vision for this, what you want to do with the school and the students. But I'm Bismarck in Oklahoma. But, uh, the school happens to be the only public secondary school in the Awutu Senior East Municipality. Wow. The only public secondary school in the Awutu Senior East Municipality. And it's a day school. But Awutu Senior East a Municipality is a, a large area. It covers a large area. And so most of the students are coming from far uh, places. Wow. So what is happening is that they've rented all around. And it's not, um... yes, and it's not promoting discipline at all. That's it. <laughs> it's not promoting discipline at all. For my vision, I will wish before I will leave the, uh, the school, the school will be converted into a boarding uh, school because the, the land is there. The land is there. And the E block was built in such a way that we have all the necessary facilities and in it. Everything is in it. Yes. And we offer six programs. Six programs. When it's because of space, we can't even admit the number of students that we need to uh, admit. Wow. And then these uh, renting around, the landlords are taking advantage of the students and it's not promoting good academic work. So that's the problem I'm facing. Wow. But I'm trying my best. Okay. And I want to make sure that before I leave, my vision for the schools make sure that the school is converted into a boarding, a boarding, a boarding school. school because it's the only public secondary school in the uh, Utu Senior, Senior East. East. Yes. And the catchment area is so large, a vast area. So uh, if, if it's happened, I'll be very glad. I'll be sure, very happy. Sure, sure. But for academic uh, vision, yes, I want to make the school an outstanding center for quality te teaching and learning and excellent outcome. Amazing. Yeah, but uh, we are hoping, we are hoping, we have, we have taken all the necessary steps because uh, the, uh, the municipality, they are aware that that's the problem we are facing. So we have a lot of hostels around. A lot of them. Yes. It's only a few of the students that are staying with their parents, then they come from their various homes to school. Most of them are staying around in rented apartments. Wow. Rented apartment. Because yeah, it's, it's a community day school. Yes. If the school was only limited mm. to mm. the people around Run. here, it would have been okay. okay. But once mm. other places from, from different from regions. From Bogase, from uh, Nyanyano, from far, 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 away. far, far away places. You see, once they are mm. all coming here, yeah. I think the boarding facilities mm. should be con mm. considered, yeah. really considered. Mm. And I know GMPC, you are doing a lot. Talo mm. Ghana, you are doing a lot. Mm. But please, extend your help to this school. Or the Ponce Senior High School. Or the Ponce Senior High School here in Kaswa. Mm -hmm. I like the landscape of yeah. this school. It has mm -hmm. so much potential. Mm -hmm. and, and we have the land. It, we have the land, the land that, is there. Yeah, we have the land that uh, we, we can get more structures on the land to convert the, the school into a boarding school. Amazing. Yeah. And we, we even need extra classrooms. Because there's sure. pressure on us. Sure. Even today, somebody came for admission. Even today. Wow. Because the only school yeah. in there. And Kaswa is, is developing fast. And the population is increasing. And so the idea of, because it's a e blog, it should be a day school, it is, it is not happening yeah, at all. Yeah, yeah, it is not happening. Yeah, yeah. The new supervision, it has to be mm -hmm. house masters, okay. senior house mistresses. We need all that. We need all that. But if you don't have the boarding yeah. facility, that is not. They are living in their hostel. Mm -hmm. You can go there and tell them that go and learn. Go and learn. And it's going no. to be a lot of work on their side. So we, we, we need 
the boarding fa facility. facility. You need a boarding facility. Sure. So I'm pleading with uh, NGOs and, and corporate organizations if they can help Definitely. Yeah, to convert the, the school, put up structures for us sure. to convert the school into sure. a boarding facility. That's my vision for, for the school. You definitely yeah. uh, realize it. Um, yeah. It's a baby school. It's been around since mm. 2016. Mm. So mm. we cannot really boast of strong mm. alumni yeah. system. We don't have, we don't even have that. We, have we are now trying to get those who left to okay. put themselves together okay. to form uh, this thing, uh, a strong uh, uh, old, yeah, student old student association. association. But for now, we don't have any vibrant old student association. Wow. And then the PA system too, uh, <laughs> you can't count on them. Wow. You can't count on them. Wow. Count on them. So um, right. this is just my time here at the DuPont Senior High School here in Central Region. A very big shout out to the Central Region Education Director, mm -hmm. Madam um justine apple of course doing tremendous amount of good what is so interesting to you about this school if you can connect with the stakeholders the ngos for them to extend their support to this school i'm going to leave the number of the administration in the description but please get in touch let us see how you can all come out and support the Ponsonia high school <laughs> Ethiopia, 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 Ethiopia.